Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me. I'm going to share with you a couple of products really quick that I received via the Octoly Skeepers. <laughs> I always say that wrong, Skeepers, because Octoly was um, maybe bought out or whatever by Skeepers or Skeppers or whatever. But anyways, I... The, the way that works is that you select a product you might be interested in and I did select a couple of products that I was really interested in and I got them. So I'm going to talk a little bit about that. I might share some empties and I don't know if I'm going to do a tag video at the end of this. I think I'll make I'll make that a separate video. But um, yeah, thank you so much for joining me. I'm not sure if you're going to see this before the holidays or right after the holidays. I think it might be afterwards. But anyways, thank you so much. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to talk about that I received from Octoly is um, a wafer that you, it's a chewable wafer. And this is sort of like... Um, a honey lemon type of a flavor it's really a nice flavor and this is from very snug so let me just tell you a little bit about this one because I I don't know about you guys but I am always on a quest for sleep the older I get the harder it is for me to sleep and the worse I look when I don't sleep so I think it's it's probably wicked normal anyways I've tried some CBD gummies and other CBD products that I really really like and I've talked about the gummies that I've been using but then I saw this and it was a chewable supplement and I thought this sounded really good and I wanted to try it so they actually have two they have a boost for the daytime which I don't have but I did get the snug which is the bedtime supplement so my normal routine goes my heat my normal routine is I will go to bed I drink some water um, go to bed and I lie in bed and I'm on my iPad and I'm reading you know reading articles or I have my ear pod my earbuds whatever you want to call them I have the earbuds in and I'm listening to a podcast or something of that nature because I really like podcasts and then at one point when I've been in there for like maybe half hour I, I take one of my CBDs and I chew that up and then the next thing you know I wake up and it might be four o'clock in the morning and and sometimes my podcast whatever I'm listening to has gone on to many others so I'm giving a, a bunch of other podcasters the credit for listening to them when I really hadn't but anyways so I've really been pleased with that but I wanted to try this wafer especially if this works as good as I think it might it'll be really come in handy when you're traveling so I received this product complimentary from very supplements um, and this is via the Octoly Skeepers Network so what this is this is actually a newer company and I think that kind of intrigued me because it's not a well-known brand or anything of that nature but a newer company and what they said on their website kind of resonated with me they said that while they're newer, they're scientists, the people that they have helping develop their product and their formulas, have actually been in the business over 20 years. And um, they're basically famous for designing for real people, as they like to say it. They believe in helping consumers feel their very best, and that's, a, that's sort of like a takeoff on their name. And um, and I thought I thought it was I thought it was interesting. So they their products line is basically designed for real people, as they say, in that if you you know if you're not feeling your best, it's going to reflect on everything you do. So they target the areas, especially the bedtime support, that I think can really help people. But what I also liked about this is that they really really believe, or at least they seem to believe, what they're touting. And they are giving 3% back of their sales to mental health charities, to charities that support awareness and, and help give access to people, you know, with issues and also resources and maybe even also developing more research. So I really kind of like that message a lot. So I ordered this. They approved me. This is the bedtime one. And it tastes really good. I've used it a couple of nights and it works 
in my opinion for me just as well as my CBD does I'll take I'll chew two of them and the next thing and I do to two of them but um, I think you need to really kind of like maybe decide how much you might want to take but it's a honey lemon it's kind of a lemony flavor so it tastes really good to me and then the next thing you know I might be listening to something and the next thing you know it's like three four o'clock in the morning and I wake up only because I have to go to the bathroom so I'm really liking these again sent to me complimentary I will link the information below you guys can check it out decide what you want to do um, if you want to try it order it whatever I just wanted to share it because because I like it the other thing I want to share and pardon me for reaching over is um, this particular product and this is this also intrigued me because this is actually a toning pad that is sort of double-sided you take the pad out I'm going to close a photo here of when I opened it so you can see how you have a, a little cover you put in with little tongs and then you can pull out a pad well the pad has two sides to it which I thought was really cool so I really like this a lot this I actually also received from from Medeca Derma M-A-D-E-C-A -E Derma and this is actually what they call their squeeze toning pad I like this so it's made from fruits and plants that contain natural say AHA and BHA so it gently will exfoliate any of your dead skin and the reason why I really wanted to try this is because I some of you know I had my most surgery I am back on the bandwagon with my retin-a full force and my skin even right now is peeling and dry so i needed to really think about toning i use the peaches toner a lot the exfoliator i should say and i really like that i'm almost out of that that'll probably be in my empties actually it is in my empties i have another one that i had replaced it with and and i really like it but this i thought was really convenient because of the packaging you can you can do one side to really exfoliate and the other side to just kind of tone and it's like 100 percent cotton it feels really good on your skin so i'm liking this a lot i like the smell it's a very it's a very fresh citrusly smell and i really like citrus a lot so i like the fact that this is not made of anything that is harmful um let me see what it says here. Yeah, so it's got a cross hole gauze side and then it has a smoother side. And it's not made of anything that is going to be harmful to your skin or anything of that nature. Just really, really nice. And I think this is going to go in my suitcase. Yeah, because I think I'm thinking, you know, traveling and stuff like that. So really, really like that. So anyways, this was sent to me complimentary via the Skeepers Network from the company. And so far, this I really like. They also have a cream. And the cream, I think, sounds intriguing. So I requested that. I don't know if they'll approve me. They have not as yet. But I requested that as well because I wanted to see how that would work with using this as a toner and then the cream. So anyways, really good stuff. Really liked it a lot. One, And I also got this one from Octoly, and this is the Clinic Zero. When I first talked about this, because the rules are for Octoly, when you get a product, you have to review it in a short period of time. And sometimes you really don't have the time to really use it for long. So when I got this, I'd only used it a couple of times, but this is the Clean It Zero. This is sort of like a gamage. And um, I really like it. It's got C in it. It's it's a brightening, peeling exfoliator, gentle. So what I do if I use the Clean It Zero sometimes to just to take off my eye makeup, or I use another oil that I have that I've talked about for my eye makeup that I really like a lot. And then after I do that, when I put this say on my skin, and I kind of put it on my dry skin and I rub it along gently and you can you can get those little beady things a little like some people think it's your skin I'm not too sure but it kind of like pulls off some of your dead skin I just like the way that feels whatever it is that's coming off my skin I really like the way it feels so this has been awesome I love clean and zero products I have purchased clean and zero products this one was sent to me complimentary reviewed it already I'll, you know, obviously submit this again, but I highly recommend this. I just think it's really, really awesome. So that's the three things that were 
sent to me complimentary. So I bought this foot exfoliation peeling mask. I've used this before in the past and I really liked it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to start treating my feet tonight so that by the time we go on vacation, my toesies will look really good and get rid of all the dry, dead skin, the heels and stuff like that. I have not been to a nail salon in I cannot tell you. I think the last time I went and had my nails and my feet done was my stepson's wedding. And that's that has been over oh almost a year and a half ago now and we went to savannah and then we went to hilton head that was our last time we were down south so i did i went to um you know obviously i went and had my nails done i went and had pedicure and all that so i haven't had any of that done and i'm going into what i hope is flip-flop territory <laughs> i hope i get to wear them but so anyways i'm going to do this and try really to you know not go to a nail salon i i'm just like not into wanting to spend 50 bucks a month to have nails put on or anything of that nature so i bought this off of i think amazon and i know i've used it before and i know i've liked it before so i'll i'll let you guys know how i do with it but i'm, I'm really excited about it a couple of things that i'm just going to share with you because i really don't have a whole lot of empties but i talked about my ear um my ear caps. Because I had the inner ear surgery, this past, this year has been like a year of, you know, health issues for me. I had my inner ear surgery. Prior to that, I could always, I always had to have something. I had a plug in there. I had a mask on, um, a cap on. So I have to be even still with my surgery. Still, I have to keep my ear dry. So I bought these off of Amazon and I just thought I'd show you because I, they come in a, in a huge pack, right? So if you if you have, um, these would be perfect if you were into playing with your Barbie dolls. You could just be a perfect shower cap for a Barbie doll, right? But anyways, I use these on my ears and I've reused them and reused them. And then at one point they just get too stretched out. Like this one is pretty stretched out. So I trash it. This one, I trash it. So even though I had my inner ear surgery, this is something I'm going to continue to, to use. Um, my surgeon says make sure that I keep my ears as dry as possible, although the healing on my repaired eardrum has been phenomenal. I'm still a little nervous, nervous about flying. Um, so I'm taking like an allergy pill and I'm also doing nasal spray consistently just to keep everything in, in check but it is um, it is it's been a year of health issues so I'm really looking forward to 2023 hopefully having more of a, uh, a, a year without health issues anyways so that's that I've been using this so this always happens to me I lose my battery and that's why I'm probably in a different position because my battery died, I had to go into the kitchen. I went into the kitchen and walked by Jay, and he took one look at me, and he started laughing. I said, what the heck are you laughing at? He goes, look at you. And he always, you know, he didn't see the wig I had on, so he always cracks up laughing when he sees me walking by with my, my hair. <laughs> anyways, getting on to my empties. Yeah, I think this kind of looks kind of different. But anyways, so this is... If you know anyone that's going through Mohs surgery, and I've talked about this for a long time because this has been my number one skincare stuff. I have been using this Biocorium, and this was recommended by my good friend Sheila. This has an SPF in it, so it is like a, a scar away. It does have that gel, the silicone that you put on your scars that help it dissipate, but it has the SPF in it. I'm still using this. I Do I have to? I don't know. Um, but I put it on, and especially right here where my scar is still pretty bad, right around my my nose here, um, because of the natural contour of my face, it's just not healing as well there as it is going up. So I use this all the time. I just bought another one. I wouldn't be without this for a while. And since my healing process for my most surgery is going to be a good year, I figure I'm going to need it. I also have 
opened up my second scar away. I use this one usually at night where I use the biocorium during the day if I'm going to be going out and all that. I use this at night. And the scar away, it can be for any kind of a scar. And if you treat it, it really does help facilitate the healing process of your scar so it doesn't look as bad. So I think this is really awesome. The other thing I finally, um, my toothpaste, I, I cut it off and I, you know, to dig in because there's always product. So when you get close to the end of something, then I just cut off an edge of it and I put it in a baggie to keep it sealed. And then I go in with, you know, a, a, I have a little, like a, a actual small little thing, dig it out, put it on my toothpaste toothbrush and brush my teeth with it. This is AP24 fluoride whitening toothpaste by New Skin. I don't sell New Skin. I'm not, um, I don't necessarily buy it off any one person. Um, I think I bought this off of eBay, a six pack or whatever. I know a couple of people that do sell this. It is a marketing um, company. I just really like the product. Yes, it's expensive, but I really like the product. So I use this, Jay uses this, and this one is ready to be trashed. The other thing that's, I'm not even gonna go into a whole bunch of details because I use all sorts of different face masks. And if I saved all my face masks, you guys would be bored silly because I'd be talking about one face mask after another, so I don't. But I also emptied this peaches. I have another one. This is the full one. I haven't started this one yet. This one, interesting enough, I dated when I started it. And I started this on January 20th. Now, do I use this every day? No. Do I use other products with it? Yes, I do. Do I love this? Yes, I do. I love this and I love their cleanser. The, these are Those are my two favorite. However, I try. I mean, you saw me talk about Clean and Zero, you, you know, or the toning pad. I use other products because I like to review them, I like to try them out, I like to see what works good. This really is awesome. I really, really like this a lot. I would highly recommend it Peaches, their products as far as the ones I use anyways. And I know other people like Natalie, the Beauty Diva, I think uses her entire line. So if you know Natalie, check out Natalie. She swears by their entire line and loves the products. So. Yeah, Peaches skincare, I love it too. This one's gone, this is empty, and that's going in my trash. So that's really it, short and sweet. Well, probably not short and sweet, but I think I'll do a separate video on a tag because I was tagged. And uh, I'm gonna do that one next. So hopefully you all had, I don't know if this is coming before or afterwards, but if it's before, hope you have a wonderful Christmas, holiday season. If it's afterwards, I hope you had a wonderful one. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.